Japan. The festival is about seven years old, so it's getting bigger and better every year. This year we're incorporating an extra day in terms of uh, an art exhibition, as well as promoting some of the artists in the community. This year we've added the cultural component of the festival, hence the name change to Yarraba Music and Cultural Festival. Um, and that's more to give festival goers the opportunity to experience the culture and experience Yarraba in a much more intimate setting with cultural workshops, with elders, and more of an opportunity to go away with a better experience and not just the music. Festival Australia's support is really important um, for the continuation of the festival and has been in the past. We're opening up the community to external visitors as well as trying to grow our local economy as well. It's promoting reconciliation and it's harnessing the raw talent around uh, performing uh, arts as well as creative arts. I was incredibly excited to get the call to be part of Yarraba Festival. Being able to come here, travel here and meet and collaborate with some of the um, local Indigenous artists is just such an absolute honour and I think it's incredible to highlight beautiful land, the beautiful people that are here. A lot of our young bands who will be featuring, they're bringing their own flavour of bringing our stories and, and, and our culture and our language into more contemporary times with modern instruments and styles of music. People look forward to it and they're so excited about having Young Australian of the Year Baker Boy as well as Yothi Yindi here this year. Such an iconic First Nations band. I think we're going to see a big sea of, you know, red, black and yellow here. We've heard about the Arabah Festival for a while and we've always wanted it. We've never yeah. played here before, so this will be our first time and really looking forward to it. Well, we want a part of Tungundi people here just to entertain and stay been looking forward for a long time. And it's uh, the legacy that taking us everywhere.